Okay, so this is me stopping a brute rush as with warthogs. Um, I'm doing this Anders just because it's the quickest, or you get hogs the quickest. You can do it with cutter and forge. You're just going to have to go reactor or third instead of second. So I'm just going to gather supplies at the beginning. Nick, what we're going to do here is we're going to port camp the brute and prevent the brute from being able to get any brutes to my base. And then it's going to force the brute to recall because I'm out building damaging him with my warthogs than he does. Okay, so the brute is going... I mean, we're just going to assume he's going temple first, so we're going to start heading over there now to try to ram the first few brutes for, yeah, there's the brute chieftain. I'm going to send that hog back there to pick off any, a brute if he gets a brute through. What she does. Okay, there's another route coming through the portal. I'm just gonna ram it. Okay, now that I'm gonna ram the brute here with my hog that I left behind. If you're playing on teams, one of your other teammates can be doing that, and you could have brought that hog with you. Okay. Now we. It's just his chieftain. Okay, now we're gonna ram that brute. Kill it. Now the chieftain's basically gonna be forced to recall because he has nowhere near as much building damage as I does, and now you've effectively stopped it. Okay, this is me stopping a brute rush with flamethrowers. I'm just gonna start off with supply pad, barracks, supply pad. Um, then I'm gonna go gather supplies with my warthogs. Um, this isn't anywhere near as good as doing it with warthogs, so if you can do it with warthogs, do it with warthogs, but that's not working for you. Here's another solution to stop the brute rush. And now I'm just going to gather supplies. Basically, we're just going to get a bunch of flamethrowers and then just throw them at the brutes since flamethrowers are the counters. So here we're going to start queuing a bunch of flamethrowers and lock the base because I won't have enough flamethrowers to really do anything by the time he gets here. So now we're going to go look for more supply pads and there's his brute. So we're going to ram that brute squad. Cord hog, maybe distract him for a second. And now I'm going to go gather supplies. Warthog again. Keep up another flamethrower. There, I built a supply pad because that forces his brute to move, and he wasn't shooting while doing that. Just bought me a second or two. There, he ports in another brute, and I do the same supply pad trick thing again, then delete it. Now I'm just going to unlock and kill those two brutes. Q. 
speed up flashbang because it's a really good upgrade. And that way he won't be able to run away from me if it lasts that long. There I keep killed both of the roots and now he's vortexing me. So I'm gonna focus on his chieftain and there he popped in another brute, so I'm gonna go kill the brute squad. So they die quicker and do more building damage, I think. Not really sure. Now I'm just gonna work on the chieftain. It's pretty much done. There, he's just gonna try to vortex me some more, but he's just getting eaten by my thing. And I'm about to kill his chieftain. And there he dies.